Hi, I couldn't resist doing this follow-up video. Because on the previous video, I, I did this um, Stirling engine with a bit of cancel wire, and Reese Isaac posted a note saying, OK, but why didn't you do that with your ink? And I thought, uh, yeah, why didn't I do that with my ink? So what I did was take the Stirling, and at the bottom here we've got a couple of copper strips, and it's painted with a square of our ink, plugged into the power supply, and there it is, happily running the Stirling engine. So a big thank you to Reese for suggesting that because I think it's awesome actually. One of the cool things about this is obviously it heats up the plate, it's really a heat engine and the, the ink is a resistive heater heating that bottom plate. So if I turn the supply off so there's no heat, it's not got any supply at the moment. So all that's keeping that running is the residual heat of the thermal mass of the bottom plate. And that'll continue to run for a good while yet actually. And I thought that was kind of interesting. And also, the power draw on this is much lower than the cancel wire, and that's not a surprise, because it's in intimate contact. So it's painted on the plate instead of being a distance away from the plate. So we're heating the plate directly, so the thing is that much more efficient, uh, and that's very cool as well. So it's a very quick and easy way to make the thing more efficient. It also is an awesome use for our ink. You get our ink on the shop, incidentally. I'll put a link in the description for it. Uh, and I just thought that was tremendous. So, um, happy Christmas, have a good new year. Thank you very much, Reese, and I'll see you in 2020.